Steve Stumpy Thomas is another player who took an unconventional route to the NHL. After playing four seasons in the OHL with the Toronto Marlboros and having varying success with his best year coming in 83-84, where he would score 105 points in 70 games, Steve Thomas went undrafted in the NHL entry draft, but would make his way to the NHL nonetheless, signing as a free agent for the Toronto Maple Leafs and playing in their AHL affiliate, the St. Catherine Saints, in 84-85 where his 90-point performance in 64 games earned him the Red Garrett Memorial Award as the AHL's top rookie. He would make a few appearances with the Maple Leafs that season as well, scoring one goal and one assist in 18 games. By the following year, he was more of a full-time player at the Toronto Maple Leafs, playing in 65 games and scoring 57 points. By the 1987-88 season, Thomas was traded to the Chicago Blackhawks where he would spend parts of the next five seasons playing in Chicago, before being traded to the New York Islanders during the 91-92 season. During the 92-93 campaign, Thomas would have his best season ever, recording 37 goals, 50 assists for 87 points. He would later spend time playing for the New Jersey Devils, back on the Toronto Maple Leafs and Chicago Blackhawks, then on the Anaheim Mighty Ducks, and finishing out his career as a Detroit Red Wing. For a player who never got drafted, Thomas spent 20 years playing in the NHL, where he played in 1,235 NHL games, scoring 421 goals, 512 assists for 933 points. He also played in 174 NHL playoff games, scoring 54 goals and 53 assists for 107 points, but sadly never capturing a Stanley Cup. He was the AHL Rookie of the Year in 1985 and won a World Championship Silver Medal in 1991 and 1996, as well as a World Championship Gold Medal in 1994, representing Canada. As of this recording, Steve Thomas has not made his way into the Hockey Hall of Fame, but it is only a matter of time until his offensive skill and longevity in the league will see him enter hockey's hallowed halls. It's all time, my game. Mr. Bobby Orson. Hey.